to the Mari Show. Now, I want, I want everybody to take a look at a photo of Lauren and her fiance, Nathan. Million dollar smiles. But Lauren's not smiling now because she's about to hear the results of a lie detector test that we gave to Nathan last night. You see, Lauren fears that Nathan is using his job as a roofer to meet women. And she suspects that Nathan may have cheated on her with one of her own family members. Watch. When people look at Nathan and I, they think we're this perfect, happy couple. But what they don't know is that the man I love, I believe, is a liar and a cheater. Nathan lied to me about going to his ex-girlfriend's house, and I am not going to stand for that. I found messages from that girl's boyfriend telling Nathan to stop seeing her. I believe in my heart that he had sex with her, and we were engaged, and I was pregnant. I found multiple dating profiles that Nathan set up online. He claims that they were from when we weren't together, but I don't believe him. We have a two-month-old son together. This is my family. This is my life. I want to marry Nathan and spend the rest of my life with him. If he fails that test, the wedding is off. You don't think he cares about you and your family? I mean, if you care about, you know, me and my family, then why would you be going to your ex-girlfriend's house when I'm pregnant and engaged? Right. Yeah. So let's go back. What worries you the most about Nathan's past? When I first met Nathan, he was seeing, you know, multiple women. Wow. One of them no. was the girl he went behind my back to see. But he says, he says he did go to her house and all they did was talk. Yeah, talk right. on the porch. Uh, exactly. Multiple times, though. He went to her house multiple times. How could you think that he would cheat on you with one of your family members? I mean, Nathan's the one who said that, like, you know, she followed him around the house and tried to grab oh, his she Yeah. She did. She did. Do you know what he thinks? What? He thinks you're cheating on him. Yeah. And so guess what? We gave both of them lie detectors. <laughs> Here's Nathan. Hi, Nathan. You all have a life together. You have a child together. You're, you're engaged. You want to get married. You wouldn't mess that up, would you? No, Maury, I'm not a stupid man. I don't like to say. You just go to your ex-girlfriend's house just to talk to her? Okay, well... Lauren, we all know that uh, you brought a man that was your ex into our relationship and lied to me about it for months and months. And I don't have to tell you about my past. I do not have to tell you about my past. You brought your past into our future. You went behind my back to see your ex-girlfriend. How's that not bringing your okay. past into my future? All right. it, do you want to look at it more? Would you look at it this way? That she has an ex, a man that she slept with, that comes right. over to our house for barbecues, right. hanging out with me, being my best. You went, years but you we went over together. to your ex girlfriend's yes. house. It doesn't to mean talk. that you can do that. Did talk several Se times? No, no, uh, I not was several times. Really? You know of every time that I've went over there. We were on her porch. Okay, no. she was dating an employee of mine. Right. Okay. Um, and I was talking to both of them about, you know, hey, you know, there's this girl, and she's nothing. I don't even really like her. And you wanted her. You she wanted her then before we got we together. We weren't exclusive or anything like this. If you wanted like her when, you know, before we even got together, you wanted her when I was pregnant. We left on good terms, came back, and then I talked to her, okay? And I didn't go and say I was a boyfriend, girlfriend with this other girl. You don't go to your ex-girlfriend's girl, house and after dark if with, you ain't trying to sleep I, with I her. I stopped with the one girl. Which one? She thinks... She thinks you're cheating while you're at work. She thinks you're cheating yes. when you go away on the job. And I'm not. No. I mean, you I don't have set hours. I don't know where town. you're going. I've only gone out of town for three weeks. You're okay? all and so, like, GPS for... track you, like, what you're doing. Oh so if God. he can't trust you, 